Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into the world of rooting and exploring what happens when you use Colonel Sue and Majisk at the same time on your phone. Now, this isn't exactly recommended, but let's use the Redmi Note 7 Pro as a springboard to understand why. As you know, the Redmi Note 7 Pro doesn't officially support Kernel Sue, but some developers have created patched kernels that allow you to use it. So, let's say you flashed one of these kernels and got Kernel Sue working, great? Now, what happens if you decide to also flash Majisk? Well, buckle up because things get interesting. Both Kernel Sue and Majisk are rooting tools, but they work in different ways. When you install both, they end up conflicting with each other. This is exactly what we're seeing here on the Redmi Note 7 Pro. See this message on Kernel Sue. Modules are disabled because of a conflict with Majisks. This is the telltale sign. Essentially, Kernel Sue is getting blocked by Majisk, rendering its module functionality useless. Since Majisk is the more dominant tool here, it takes control. You'll still be rooted, but you'll only be able to use Majisk for managing root access and flashing modules. Kernel Sue becomes a backseat passenger. So, why not just use both? Here's the thing, these conflicting tools can lead to instability, unexpected behavior, or even boot loops. It's simply not worth the risk. The key takeaway is to choose one rooting tool and stick people with it. Majisk is generally the preferred option due to its wider support and features like hiding root from apps. Thanks for joining this exploration of rooting conflicts. If you have any questions about rooting or your specific device, leave a comment below. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech adventures.